Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome to more family friendly gaming with Soap the Great. Today we are doing a little server how-to's here on the 2Crafty Vanilla Amplified server. And these are going to be coming to a, an end real soon. I believe this is going to be the last one. Today we're going to take a look at how to use the squid farm. That's right, recently completed. And what you need to do is you need to come to my base. And instead of going towards my base, well, I guess you could. Uh, you need to come behind the portal into this area here. And um, it depends on how you want to get over there. Now you can take a water route this way. Or if you really want to, you can walk all the way on those piers and go all the way around. You see how that bridge just kind of goes around. And if you want to do that, that's fine. But uh, grab a boat. And if you don't have a boat, come over here. And I've left some wood in here. And then uh, there is a crafting bench there. Excuse me while I turn off this phone. Okay. And uh, you can put together a boat there. And then what we're going to do, just jump in the boat. And we are going to go kind of in a thisserly direction. Southeast. Southeast? Southwest from the base. Southwest? Yeah, 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 yeah. And we're going to come over to a similar structure on this side. I meant to change from night to day. You can see we've got a boat over there already. So I'm kind of worried about what we're going to encounter because, as you can see, oh, once I get up here, I have no armor. Yeah, so this is going to be fun. But we want to come on this pathway. And we'll just go up. Hopefully, it's not too bad. We might have some visitors as we go. But no problem. And we're just going to come along this path. And we're, this takes us to the squid farm. So if you just follow this, I'm, I'm going to keep on this. It doesn't take too long to get to it. Wow, it looks so nice. Look at that amplified right there. Amplified mountains. It's gorgeous. And then we come along the path and it goes straight to the squid farm. So you can't really miss it. There's no nether portal to get to it. Uh, so you just come in through here. And you can see something coming into view. And what we're going to do, just as a convenience, we've got two of those ender chests. And this is an AFK farm. And you can just stand here and wait for all the squid to drop. You can watch them too if you want to. But um, I found that all of the black all around, the black colors here, kind of messes up the video quality. So um, what you want to do, you you want to start at least in this chest. Uh, the squid or the ink sacs start dropping into this column first, and then they'll start moving on around. You can see we're up to this one when it's filling up, and then you can just come all the way around. If you find that all of them are empty, just wait for a little bit, and this one will start filling back up. Just grab the ink sacs that you want, and then you can chuck them into the ender chest, and Bob's your uncle and then head on back that way. So that's how to use a squid farm. Hopefully it is fairly simple. And uh, oh, if you ever need to get to the mechanics, put a redstone torch on this block. So find the, what is it, the leftmost purple block on this wall and a redstone torch beside it, okay? And that's gonna open up a door somewhere in here. I can't remember where, I didn't bring a redstone torch with me, so. So yeah, there you go. Anyway, hopefully you do find this farm useful, and hopefully you have enjoyed this video. Anyway, that's all for now. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>